And here's right. Connor with the foot in the door phenomenon. The foot in the door phenomenon is a compliance tactic that involves getting a person to agree to a large request by first setting them up by having them agree to a modest request. Frank, do you mind uh, getting me some gold? Stereotype. It is a widely held but fixed and oversimplified image or idea of our particular type of person or thing. Ready. Ready filming. Set. Action. All right. Uh, we're here with, with Matt and Betsy here. Uh, what do you guys know about stereotypes? What is a stereotype? Well, they go all around the school. Uh, everyone has them. Um, I guess like cheerleaders, like sports, um, clubs, I guess. I don't know. Do you think uh, stereotypes are positive or negative for the most part? Both. Both for the most part, negative. Yeah. Wonder sometimes stereotypes can be positive. Um, I don't really know. I guess they're mainly negative. <laughs> mainly negative. Uh, in your day to day routines, what kind of stereotypes do you guys run into? Ha, have there been and jocks and everyone making fun of them in different ways. Have there been times recently where where you've either uh, been stereotyped or used stereotypes? Um I'm sure there has been. Be honest, give us an example. Okay. What was the question? <laughs> and any times you've either used stereotypes or been stereotyped? You obviously have used a stereotype at one point. Yeah, so I have, it's a judge free environment. I have been there when you used a stereotype. Can you give me an example of one that I've used? I'll say Mesa. Okay. Um, <laughs> well, it's going to sound kind of bad, but there's this kid on our baseball team, Romus Mesa, and uh, we make fun of him a lot for cutting the lawns. <laughs> That's not. <laughs> Why? Why do you do that? Yeah. Um, because he, he kind of goes along with it, so, and... But why did we choose him, of all people on the team? We're trying to give a framing of why and when. Okay. For those of us who don't know Romus. Yeah. Um... <laughs> Two words. <laughs> Would you say that it's all in good fun? Yes. When you stereotype? Yes. Not trying to be mean. I mean, most if, of the time. If you were in his shoes, though, wouldn't you see how stereotyping can definitely be harmful to someone's, I don't know, self-confidence? To some people, but he, it's, I know that, it, yeah, it's our friend, and I know he's not taking it the hard way because he goes along with it. Do you think a uh, majority of stereotyping is in good fun nowadays, or do you think there's a lot of, uh, there's, there's a lot, lot of harsh stereotyping? Yeah. 
Especially if you do with the people you're not friends with. Yeah. Okay, so if you were picking a basketball team, what kind of people are you looking for on that team? You don't get to see any of their skills. Visually, you just they're just standing as straight as I am. From right stereotypes, now. what would you use? Stereotypes, like black people. There you go. That's the answer. It's golden. I mean, you're golden, pony yeah, boy. That's a stereotype. Um, any other Asian questions you guys can make? I don't really know, think so. Thank you for this. Sign out, guys. Good. Say thank yeah, you. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. You're welcome. Bye. Oh, oh, we're f just too popular. All right. Dolan. Dolan. What are you, uh, what are your, uh, what's your idea of stereotypes? Stereotypes? <laughs> yeah. Oh, boy. Uh, let me, let me tell you something about stereotypes. They're everywhere. Do, do you have any stereotypes yourself? Do I have any stereotypes? Well, I mean, be honest. Not gonna lie, if I see a pretty lady, you know, sometimes, you know, I'm just like, yeah, like, I don't know, I, I, got, I got some stereotypes. Don't be, don't be afraid. Well, uh, let's hear some examples. What are some stereotypes? Some that you, uh, stereotypes you use commonly, there. like, um, be honest. Stupidity. I mean, some, sometimes I think. People if you were picking a playground really basketball team, what, what, who would you look for to be good on basketball? Kids with the muscles. Man. Any, uh, anything else? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm not gonna lie. Right. There's, there's some stereotypes. Say so you got five white kids and a black kid, who would you pick? Oh, come on. Come on. <laughs> Put me on the spot there. Just um, answer it honestly. That's who what would you asking. honestly pick? A million dollars. As if you were. Yeah, I'd look at their, I'd look at their makeup as a basketball player. He looks like Michael ball. Jordan. He looks like Michael Jordan. Michael <laughs> Jordan. All right, there I you go. Jordan. It's like Scalabrini you know, versus you. Jordan. I, I he's handicapped. I take Jordan. Yes. What if it turns out he sucks? Well, then we'd be saying you just uh, stereotyped him at that point. Um, you know, hey. Just, just walk, just walk around. <laughs> it's a casual setting, yeah. so it's okay. Uh, you know, then, then I would be at fault of the stereotype. But, um, Trout, yeah, get over here. Uh, this is, is kind of weird. I don't want to seem like a racist. No, you're not, you're not. <laughs> no, this, that'll actually yeah. be preferred. You know what? <laughs> All right, so another question would be, um, uh, the question would be stereotyping. Yes. Do you think it's uh, it's more prevalent in a affluent community or in a lower, I don't know, a less fortunate community? Uh, I'd say it's, I'd say it's, I'd say it's, I'd say it's prevalent in both places. Uh, I'd say in a place like a high school, it's definitely a lot more um, stereotype prevalent. Uh, <laughs> High schools, uh, they tend to have a lot of stereotypes. Yeah. So. Thank you, of course. Oh, wait. This yes. One second. Okay. Don't let that fall. These are good enough. Try them. Okay. okay. Um, so, uh, yeah. Um, <laughs> but uh, stereotypes, they do happen in effluent communities. I think a little more, I'd say. Okay. I don't think so. I feel like people are a little more judgmental. You know, yeah. when, you're, when you're in the city, you know, you're all just kind of together. Yeah. As one yeah, bonding in the neighborhood, you know. Since you were holding their stuff, do you mind carrying my backpack for my next hour? I, I, just, I'm it sure. won't be a problem. I, I, I have bad backpacks. So I'm not sorry. I'm not sorry. Last question. That's, that's last question. That's uh, more many, I think. Um, stereotyping. Yes. Can it sometimes be good? In some cases, we'll it can be like a buffer in society. It can be. I, I, I'm, a, I'm not a believer in stereotypes, but I'm a, I'm a supporter. Of something. <laughs> uh, Give us one example where you think it could be good. Like, say, if you walk into a bank, what kind of ethnicity or religion would oh, you trust? Oh, come on. That is. <laughs> you, you can't <laughs> All I'm gonna say is, some people are better at some things than other people. And you know what? Some people just look the part, man. And you know what? It's who, life. Define it's that life. part. Who would you hire to mow your lawn? To mow my lawn. No. That's it. That's not. Probably that's next it. <laughs> <laughs> Here's our next interviewee. This uh, kid just. Uh, yeah, I'd hire anybody to mow my lawn. Mowing my lawn. Uh, Alrighty. Alrighty. All right. All right. All right. Next interview. Thank you very much, Dolan. Thanks, Dolan. Of course. Ryan you are. Hi, White. How you doing? Good. I have a question for you, White. Alright. About stereotypes. Do you know what stereotypes are? Define what a stereotype might be in your opinion. Um, I think it's referring to somebody um, as like referring to somebody as what they're like referring to like ethnicity or something. It's not an ethnicity. No, I think we understand. Yeah. yeah. Can stereotypes be a negative thing? What? Can stereotypes be a negative thing? Um, in some cases, yeah. Have you ever used it in a negative way? Yeah. Really? Yeah.
give us, um, in a way that they're negative, they obviously hurt society at that point. Um, can you give me an example of which you feel like you've been probably someone who's done that? And Either used like stereotypes or had, had stereotypes, stereotypes have used you against you. Yes. Yeah. Have I been stereotyped? Yes. Uh, no, not not really. More you, like a, you look like a goon. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> I'm kidding. Go on. I mean, uh, <laughs> I'm just I I think like when you like, call somebody like a Jew or something, <laughs> it'd be like a hurtful one. Not really, though, okay. Okay, and, uh, if you were picking a player on a basketball team, who would, uh, and you had a certain amount of, like, what would be, what would be a good for? candidate? Yeah, what would be a good candidate? Describe what you would want on your team. Oh, um, seven foot, big guy. So it has nothing to do with talent or well, skill? No, yeah, oh, oh, talent. You don't know their necessary talent. More, what you would look for visually, like, when you see them. I mean, usually African American. Yeah, that's for, normal. That's a stereotype right there, Wyatt. I hope you know that. Not really. Yeah. It's really good at basketball. <laughs> that is a stereotype. I guess. Well, I mean, all right, Wyatt, have a good day, my friend. Thanks. Thanks, Wyatt. Thank, Thank you very much. much. What we found in our studies with foot in the door phenomenon is that uh, it held true in that when we gave uh, a subject one of our books or objects, uh, they would then comply to hold more and more of the stuff we gave them until it got pretty ridiculous. Um, yeah. with, uh, with stereotypes, we found that uh, pretty universal. Everyone thought the same thing. When we would frame certain questions, they would say what you'd expect anyone to say, especially in this area. And um, it's pretty normal response. And as mean or judgmental as it may be, they said what was on their mind, and unfortunately, it's very true in a lot of people's opinions. Uh, social loathing. Social loathing is the phenomenon of people exerting less effort to achieve a goal when they work in a group rather than when they work alone. All right, guys, if we want to get an A on this product, we're going to work hard. Yeah. Uh, some ideas. All right. So, what are we thinking? Foot in the door, door went well. Foot in the door is pretty Yeah, good. but really, uh, probably someone should take some charge or something. Yeah. Connor, you got any ideas? What am I supposed to get this only using headshots? It's ridiculous. Do you know how hard, it's, it's you know how hard it is to kill a Kodiak this, this is a big one. Kodiak bears take at least two shots, and I have to kill three of them with all headshots. Cody, what was your high score on Poppy Jump? I couldn't tell you, but I bet it was higher than yours. So, you're gonna do it. When are we taping? I guess we tape tomorrow. Or Frank, you can do like the work and stuff. You're gonna have to like do some work. And, uh,